Now to an update on a story we first told you about last week on WTVA 9 News. Sheriff's deputies arrested the driver in a deadly hit and run investigation involving a horse. WTVA's Gabe Maynard live in Clay County with that new information. Investigators charged the driver with leaving the scene of an accident earlier this afternoon. Now this is a misdemeanor charge, which surprised us because a horse was killed as a result of the hit and run. We do have the man's name, but we're not going to identify it because this was not a felony charge. Take a look at the suspect's truck. The damage is extensive. This is what ultimately led to his arrest. It matched the color of the truck reported by the victim. The hit and run happened last week on Old Waverly Road. The truck's mirror was actually found at the scene. The horse's rider was hurt, but the teen is recovering. The horse, unfortunately, had to be put down due to injuries. I talked to the sheriff and to the boy who was riding the horse at the time of the hit and run. A lot of information come from the community, just, just calling us and, and kind of giving us tips. And we actually checked, uh, no, probably a couple dozen um, tips that came through, you know, and ran them down. <clears throat> and this was one that paid off. It made me feel a lot better than, than what I was feeling the night of. The night of, it was, oof, can we find the guy? It was like a mystery, but we're getting some answers, so it feels good. The driver could face 30 days to one year in jail and fines up to $5,000 if he's convicted. Live in Clay County, Gabe Maynard, WTV 8 9 News.